beaches. The Albufera Nature Reserve faces the sea. From Pinedo in the north to the town of Cullera in the south, it has sandy beaches along the coast stretching for some 31 kilometers, only interrupted by the five inlets or canals that connect the lake to the sea. On these beaches, the sand comes from materials that rivers drag and deposit in their estuaries. The sea, with its currents and waves, takes this sediment and moves it, finally depositing it on the beach. In the case of the Albufera, the Turia River has provided the sand to create the beaches over thousands of years. In the Albufera, there are beaches for all kinds of visitors covering their different needs. There are some that can be accessed by vehicle and others only on foot. Some have first aid shelters, showers, an umbrella and beach chair rental services whereas other more unspoiled beaches are difficult to access and do not offer these services. When visiting the beaches, we must always keep in mind that this is a fragile environment of great natural importance. Therefore, even though our only intention is to spend the day having fun, we may have an impact that would be difficult to reverse. Just focusing on the Devesa from El Saler to El Perayonet, we can see that the further south we go, the beaches are left in more natural conditions. Here we must be most careful. Some birds, such as the plover, use hollows in the sand to lay their eggs and raise their chicks, while others dart about the water's edge in search of food washed ashore. Currently, the beaches in the Albufera are suffering from a lack of sediment provided by the rivers and from the barrier effect caused by the port of Valencia, leading to a reduction in the size of the beaches throughout the protected zone. <laughs>